What's up guys, 67 Irish Farmer here working on the Husqvarna 576 XP. I just put a new piston on it and I'll show you guys what the orientation of that piston is supposed to be. Let's see if we get that straight up and down. Take that back a little bit, maybe you can see it better. Can you guys not see, see that arrow right there? That is supposed to be pointed towards the exhaust side on the cylinder head. The exhaust is right here. And then the piston rings. I don't know if you guys can see. See these little indents right there where my fingernail is? There's one there and there's one up here. Those are for your piston rings, your stops. And they're supposed to be on the intake side. The stops the piston ring from rolling all the way around. I just now I have to wait for the gas to come in. Maybe I'll make my own. And then I got the top end as well. New cylinder head. I put the vibration dampening spring on there. And I also put the decompression valve on there. Right there. Won't we'll focus, of course. But that is new cylinder head. It's, it's genuine Husqvarna. I don't think they make an aftermarket for Husqvarna 576 XP. Once that is done, there's the old piston. There's the old head, and here's the old piston. The top of that piston versus the top of this piston. You can tell it's a lot nicer. Um, there's the old gasket. I'll probably just copy this one and make a new one myself. And then, uh, what else is there? I have the bar for it right here, the top cover, uh, the side cover, and I also got the muffler here. I think the gasket's forward in here as well. That's that. I was hoping I'd get this running today, but I opened up the box and found out I don't have the gasket for it. Once I get that in, I'll show you guys how to put that back together. You gotta compress, compress the piston ring so it fi fits inside that cylinder head. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. That's the intake right there. A little guard that goes up against that. And then, you got the air cleaner. There's really not much to it. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe. Stay tuned for more, especially on this saw. Uh, can't wait to get this thing running. Catch you next time.